Hey family, hey look, I'm here with the USBC, Greater Richmond, USBC Association President, Miss Vicki Ringers. Just wanted to sit down and discuss with her a few things about the sport of bowling as it relates to not only our association, but the sport of bowling in general. And I thought it'd be a good person to talk to, especially when <laughs> we come here on the heels of our city tournament. We just concluded uh, two weekends of our city tournament. So why not talk to the Queen Bee? <laughs> why not talk to the Queen Bee? So I want to introduce again, Miss Vicki Ringer. She is our association president. Uh, how many of you have been the president now? 12. 12, 12 years. years. She served as the president. And that, isn't it something else you also do in the state? Or I'm a director on the state USBC, okay. Virginia State USBC. Okay. Yep. All right, good stuff, good stuff. So she's been around the game for a little bit. And she's uh, not only just bowling, um, she's accomplished a few things on the lanes, but she's also made a huge impact in our industry, uh, in our bowling world, uh, at, on the political side of things. And so I uh, just wanted to sit down and speak with her real quick about a few things. And uh, But first, uh, Vicky, tell me, uh, how did you get involved with the political side? of? How did you get involved with bowling and then how did you get to the political side of things? Um, I started out bowling just for fun. Mm -hmm just with friends and um back at azalea um azalea <laughs> yeah that was a, one of the first centers i yeah. bowled in mm -hmm. and then um joined a league in the like late 80s and mm -hmm. just took it up <laughs> right right and so then you eventually evolved over into the political side of things and i did i so how did, how did that how did that I started on the women's um board back in the 80 well early 90s I guess it was and um, just as a director and just got more and more interested in promoting the sport and all the behind the scenes mm -hmm. stuff to do with bowling and meeting all the new people right. and yeah so I went from there to we merged in mm -hmm. 2010 the associations merged and I was the first president of the merged association and been there since right, ever since <laughs> <laughs> They ever know you're doing something right. They're keeping you there. Yeah. You're doing something right. Making a <laughs> difference. Trying. So that's awesome. So, uh, like I said earlier, I just say, stated that we just finished our city tournament. And um, so uh, let's just talk real quickly about the tournament. How do you think it went? Um, what are some of the changes you have seen over the years um, since you've been president and, you know, in, as it relates to the tournaments? With the tournaments, it's basically just the, the, the drop in participation. Okay. Um, it goes along with um, the drop in membership, mm -hmm. but you know, um, this year the tournament was up from last year. That's great. Um, that's great. That's good. And kudos to you and your staff. Yeah. yeah. So that's the biggest change that, mm -hmm. that we've seen, right. and um, just kind of making some tweaks with the tournament, you know, rules and. Right. How it runs. Yeah. Um, basically. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> yeah. Any any challenges that you have seen um, that you know just makes it a little bit more difficult, or uh, you see some opportunities there? Or? Um. Well, we've added a new tournament for okay. seniors. We yeah. added that yeah. senior tournament a couple yeah. years ago. Mm -hmm. So um, that's you know another opportunity for for our bowlers, but. Um, the biggest chain uh, or the biggest obstacle that we hear from from bowlers is just the promoting it right, you know right. getting yes. advertising marketing mm -hmm. and we do the best we can you right. know we we have a website we have a Facebook page and um, you know a good relationship with the centers that we can advertise in the centers and right. stuff so so what's your Facebook page um, Facebook it's GRUSBC GRUSBC or Greater Richmond, Greater Richmond. Greater Richmond, yeah. Yeah, Greater Richmond, USBC. USBC yeah. So that's your Facebook page, and then your and website, the website is, is, is grusbc.com. Uh, grusbc. So any information you need about the Greater Richmond Association, please make sure you go to the Facebook page. Make sure you go to the website. Uh, if you have any questions or comments or concerns or anything that you uh, would like to see or um, some things that we could possibly change, I'm yeah. sure they're open to, to hear. Um, that's the only way we can grow. That's the only way we can get better and uh, make it, you know, better for everybody is that we all, you know, just kind of participate and, 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 and bounce ideas off of each other. Uh, 
we need this sport, right? Because this sport is important to us. Because I think one of the things, and I think you probably can agree with me, is that one of the reasons why we bowl is not just to cut just because of the competition, but the relationships. The relationships. The relationships. That's relationships, a big part. That's that's a huge part, it right? <laughs> so, the relationships is what kind of keeps us going with this, and so. Um, you know, please, you know, uh, bowling is a sport that's near and dear to a lot of us. Um, I know for me, it's been a blessing to me. me too. Uh, I know it's kept me out of trouble and all of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, you know, it's just a beautiful thing. And I, like I said, I wanted to sit down and speak with you. Uh, but before we go, because uh, I'm not going to, I know you're trying to close up shop and everything. <laughs> um, but, um, you know, so what do you, if you can share, what are some of the things you would like to see? Uh, not only is that in our local association, but um, from a national standpoint, because you also attend the national I meetings do. and so forth, right? Yeah. So I can relate to that going to the national meetings with mm -hmm. TNBA. So um, what are some of the things that you would like to see or you think you're, you're, you're seeing this on a change or anything? Yeah. I know I kind of put you on the spot with that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm not saying can't think off the top of my head I mean other than you know continue to try to grow the sport right. you know with um, promote the sport well then what, what, what let's, just, let's just speak about that so what 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 does that look like like what what do you think are some of the things that we can do to uh, I mean the one of the thing I mean the biggest thing to me is reaching out to the kids you right. know I mean I, I realize the kids have many other activities they can be involved in and um but i mean that's where it starts growing it basically is is with it with their youth so if we can get more more youth involved in in the sport that helps maybe the parents will yeah. come along yeah. too yeah. yeah so yeah i think that's huge i mean the youth is definitely important uh, and i think and, and for me personally i think not only the youth getting them involved in the sport from a competitive standpoint. But I think we also need to start grooming them for the political side of things as well. Yeah. You know, because, um, you know, I, me being a part of TNBA and been part of TNBA for so many years, um, I often speak about that myself. And it's something that I think that's very important for us in order for the future of our sport to continue. Oh, yeah. So, um, you know, that's something that, you know, we got, we got to continue. We got to go out and find them. We got to go out and reach right. out for them. You know, we can't sit around and wait for them because, and I often say this all the time, is that I got into the political side of things because someone came and said, we want you to be a part of this. It, they saw something in me. I didn't know it. All I want to do is vote. You know, I still that way. That's, that's all basically I want to vote. how you know? I, especially with the merged mm -hmm. association, I had people come to me and say i think you're perfect for this you, you know go. that you, you have there what you it go. takes to to handle all this change and they saw Is something the right because you're still here <laughs> <laughs> they saw something they were right they so, hit it on yeah. the head it, but yeah yeah I, would, the, I agree with you with the kids because you know they they need to know it's not just come out and have fun and, yes. and bowl that yes. there is some yes. the the political yes. stuff behind it. Yes. So yeah. And then the reality that's not for everybody. Right. We know it's not for everybody. <laughs> so we have to find them. We have to find them, and then we have to groom them. We have to teach. Um, expect mistakes yeah. to be made um, because God knows I made my share of mistakes. Um, but the beautiful thing is they didn't get rid of me. They let me stay in and and and, and taught me and showed me what I needed to do. So. Um, Vicky, I'm not going to hold you any longer. I appreciate you. I appreciate uh, just wanted to sit down and talk and wanted to introduce to everybody our association president, uh, Miss Vicky Ringers here in Greater Richmond, USBC. <laughs> so she's still here making it do what it do as best as she can. But again, go check out the Facebook page, go check out the website. Uh, anything that you, any questions, comments, concerns, or uh, any visions that you have to help our association help the sport of bowling um please share that okay because that's this is a sport that's near and dear to a lot of us and we want to make sure that the future of it continues so um thank you for your time thank you for listening vicky thank you for your time thank you Mom. i ain't gonna hold you any longer go handle your business so you can get up out of here it's right. been a long two weekends for you <laughs> yes. but i appreciate everything you're thank doing you. thank you appreciate thank you, you. bye guys